For our next question, we're going to try trial and error with 4x squared minus 16x plus 15. Now, with 4x squared minus 16x plus 15, I usually advise people to try the option that are closest together. So, I could call 4x squared 2x times 2x, or I could call it 4x times 1x. I'll probably try the 2x times 2x first. And then, um, you know, I, I try uh, to come up with two numbers. I multiply to positive 15. Naturally, I think a positive number is first, but then I realize I'm going to have to have a negative middle term, which means I want to have two negative numbers. So what two negative numbers multiply to positive 15? Well, I could try negative 15 and negative 1, but that won't work. That'll give me minus 30x minus 2x, so that, that will definitely not work. But again, I usually like to try. I find that these questions usually will, well, more often than not, will involve uh, the options that are closer together rather than the ones that are farther apart. So two numbers that multiply to positive 15 could be negative 5 and negative 3. So I try them. 2x, uh, sorry, 2x times 2x is 4x squared minus 10x minus 6x, so that works, plus 15. I got it.